and today's video we're checking into Hyatt Place Dubai Jumeirah. This is a four-star hotel. The average cost for this hotel is 110 US dollars. You have one bathroom and it's a tub shower combo. It does have a sofa. The sofa does turn into a bed which is really nice and then we got the one with two beds and then you have a working station right here. I'm good. Still complete. Hi guys, welcome back to another video. If it's your first time here, thanks so much for watching. And today's video, we're checking into Hyatt Place, Dubai Jumeirah. This is a four-star hotel. The average cost for this hotel is 110 US dollars. So you get a good idea of what a basic entry-level hotel looks like. So with that said, my name is Ahmed and let's get started. So we just got here, so let's show you the room before the kids show up. All right, so when you walk in, you have a storage area with luggage. You have one bathroom and it's a tub shower combo. Nice sink area. You can shower with a handle. And it's got pocket doors that you can close. It does have a sofa. The sofa does turn into a bed, which is really nice. It's helpful when you have kids. And then we got the one with two beds. And then you have a working station right here and one TV on the wall. And it's a pretty spacious room. It's really nice, not bad at all. You got a nice mirror on the wall. And then the views are the port views. So that's, you know, this is the industrial side of Dubai. So you're gonna get a lot of port views here. You got a kid park right next to it. So not your fancy five-star, you know, two rooms, all kind of crazy stuff, but this is literally a basic room, entry-level hotel, four-star which is pretty good. And this is what 110, 120 bucks a night get you. All right, let's go get the kids and show them the room. See if they're excited or not. Cuckoo, cuckoo. That was fast. Mar was sick. <coughs> Sita, what do you think? Park. You see park? We want to go. Oh, very soft. Very soft? Yeah. From five star Hilton to. No, it's nice. I like it. Still comfy. Comfy. Eh? No. Hello? I am good. <laughs> Which one? Singapore? Yeah. Little India? Yeah. All right, so they're a little excited. They were thinking the room was going to be a lot worse, but it actually turned out pretty good. So let's take them to a park, get them tired, and see how today goes. Ready? Yeah. You ready? Yeah. Yeah. You scared? No. Mean Sido riding the swing. Mean Sido riding the swing. Mean Sido sleeping on the swing. Mean Sido sleeping on the swing. Baba, Baba. Baba. All right guys, so we're getting ready to check out, but before that, I want to show you the uh, swimming pool. So let's go check it out. So it looks like it's got a bar you can swim up to. Of course, it's you know, a bit chilly, so nobody here. You got a grill area over there. Uh, plenty of buildings, give you plenty of cover from sun. It's a good area, not bad at all. All right, so let's do overall feedback of the hotel. Honestly, for 120 bucks, 110 bucks a night, it's not bad at all. You get free breakfast, free internet, so you can't beat that. You got a free swimming pool, location is pretty good. 
It's on Wassel Road, so you can literally just take the bus down, taxi down, and you ride at JBR. A lot of the uh, popular areas, so it's not bad at all. And the hotel is very clean. You know, it's Hyatt, and I think that's what Hyatt is known for. It's a very clean area. Massage, they had a buy one get one free special. So me and Sara did a massage here, which is pretty cool. So for 500 local currency, both of us got a 90 minute massage each. So that's what we got. So with that said, let's go check out the hotel and head over to our next hotel. Alright guys, one of the cool things I forgot to mention about this hotel, there's a supermarket literally right underneath it. It's like a 30 second walk, if that, and it's open to, from 7 a.m. till midnight and they literally have everything. A lot of stuff is organic, so we've been going there a lot, um, so that's been really, really helpful. So we that's really helped us out a lot. And there's a park right behind it too, uh, the kids have enjoyed it, and a mosque, and there's a masjid right next to it as well. So a lot of things right around it, a couple of barber shops that I've went to, really nice ones, professional, luxury. So we've enjoyed our stay, but with that said, we have two more videos coming your way in the end you can click on. Thanks so much for watching. If you're not following us, please do so. And I'll see you on the next video. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Who's back there? Me. You? Who's you? Who is you? What's your name? Sida. Sida? Your name is Sida? And Maria. Maria? What's your name? Black jacket. Marwa? No, you're Marwa got a new black jacket. She's been rocking a leather jacket. <laughs> All right. Headed over to our next hotel. We're gonna be staying there for six days. So this is our final hotel in Dubai before we head over to Abu Dhabi. I have a surprise for the kids in Abu Dhabi. Sara, what's up? Okay. How you doing? <laughs> All right guys, that's it, peace.